Good morning, welcome to Lainey's Crafting Creations. I'm just here to do a glaze opening. I tried last night, but it was just a little bit too um, warm in there. I took the temperature through the top. So um, let's get the camera looking down here. I'm excited to see what everything's turned out like. Okay. Lots of nice color. Got some more of the wee mushrooms to go in pot plants. And I made this little stand just to poke the um, ends in just so that they wouldn't hopefully roll over. So it did work this one. tray turned out really nice I like that it's really pretty so I'll have to make sure that eggs actually still fit in there and my herb markers A little bit of dirt on this one I do because of the hole in the top that sometimes a little bit falls in I need to remember to not place anything right under it but it's going to be in the garden anyway so they can get good just made this little bowl and I used uh, one of the jungle gems on it so that turned out cute too Christmas decoration and then I'll have a pile of these leaves in here for the um, wind chime I don't have any of the bar to hang them on so I don't do both sides I just do one so but they sound like they'll be good okay so don't think it got really hot enough so the 6 will always, 06 will always fall down but the 05 has only just started to go which is a bit of a bugger but okay okay I've got I did another one of the cactus ring holders but this time I used underglaze to decorate it so it looks cute and comic-y Some more of the garden markers. The other egg tray. So I like how that turned out too. A while ago I was just testing out my little stamp so I just made this thin little thing that'll just I'll put somewhere in my craft room. The bumblebee jumper decoration. I like how that turned out. Two of the family of ghosts, just like the same as you've seen before. Okay, so same with the cones at the bottom, didn't really reach 05, so need to work on that. It is manual, so I have to kind of play around with trying to find the, the perfect way. I put this back in with clear um, to cover up the patches that missed but I probably should have put some underglaze on there first but okay at least it's all sealed now okay. the last two of the alphabet family ghosts I 
had this little house I'd done a long time ago, so I just put some jungle gems on that. So that turned out good. Another decoration. These are the wee hearts that I had just made with some leftover clay, so they're just glazed on one side. And here is the little bee bowls that I thought I would try to do with put a stake in the bottom and put them in the garden so if I can I'll take photos if I can find something to use for a stake then I'll take photos and put it in here uh, I did this little bowl and I coated it into uh, I think it was two coats of black and then put the jungle gems on it and it actually has some really cool detail coming through and then this one I just put one of my blues on there here is the top to the wind chime really like this green Okay, there's two of the graduation ghosts. They look good. Here is the peas in the pod decorations. So they turned out really good too. my graduation um, ghost for my son who's just graduated as a nurse and then last one is the punk rocker ghost so I gave him a purple mohawk and some tattoos so he turned out cute too Thanks for watching. I will get some photos taken, string up the wind chime, and then upload this video. Thank you.